I finally figured out how to get my mic to work after being in here for almost 20 minutes and thinking my mic What if was I just working. immediately banned you? <laughs> <laughs> what if we all started chanting Barry oh B. Benson? Whose laugh is that? <laughs> Someone has a laugh that is terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> we need to narrow this down. Who is this laughing meme? Is, is it? No, that's not him. <laughs> 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 Hey, like, where did Joker that- where just... did that laughing clown go? He's still here. Awesome! Can I please jump on the bandwagon of making a video about weapons that I think should be added to the game? Because my sub box has not filled with DLC weapons, weapon leaks, potential we Can we just please cut out all the subtle requests and just add a f***ing stinger to the game? Because that's definitely what I want. I want a f Stinger. You know what a stinger is? It's that auto-seeking shoulder fire rocket that can effortlessly track and destroy aircraft with the pull of a trigger. Don't act like you don't want it, because the mass majority of my deaths in this game are three things. Aircraft, sniper rifles, and nade spin. And although it's not historically accurate, getting to use a stinger would cut out a third of those annoyances. Rampage! Come on, man, I was on a horse killing spree. When I hit a plane spot on with the AT rocket gun, which requires you to be prone or set up on an object, by the way, and only partially damage it, I think that's a little unfair. That shit is fucking trash. Sniper rifles may be annoying, but they're never really gonna go away, and the whole nade spam thing, not a huge fan. Especially as the assault class, because you can equip anti-tank grenades as a gadget and have your default grenades. That makes it so you can potentially have four grenades to toss as soon as you spawn in, which is kind of a joke. So in response to all this cheese, which Ugh, so annoying. I like to run around with what I refer to as the God Gun. Yeah, I was recently watching a video from this guy named Operator Drewski that was called the king of all shotguns in BF1, which I thought was well done, but at the same time, in the words of the real Slim Shady, I just drank a fit the Kool-Aid. Dare me to drop? Wait, that's the- Why be a king when you can be a god? That's the right one. Introducing the Model 10A, a gun so amazing the game outright tells you when you unlock it. You've got three different types in the Model 10A Broken, the Model 10A More Broken, and the Model 10A Why Does This Even Exist? And I was originally under the impression that it was just an ordinary shotgun until I actually started using it. What? It's just an ordinary crabby- OH MY GOODNESS! Completely and utterly overpowered, and if this thing doesn't get nerfed, I don't know what will. Just so we're clear, I do not at all recommend using the slugs variant of the 10A. It kind of just defeats the purpose of using a shoddy. <laughs> like if I'm wanting to use an insta-kill weapon, I need it to instantly kill people on a consistent basis, which the slugs do not. Although the slugs can instantly kill in close quarters, there's too many instances where you need a second shot to kill someone, and as far as it being a long-range threat, it's not at all. Like, when you're up against guns like the Martini Henry, forget about it. If I'm using a shotgun, I need to consistently one-shot people at close range, and that's much easier to accomplish with a 10A Hunter or Factory. The only difference between the two is that the Factory recovers from recoil faster, and the Hunter has a tighter pellet coat. That's it. So the real lesson here is to stop playing Roblox and learn how to aim with the Hunter. But, but, I have noticed that the Factory version of the 10A works best when you pretend that you're a worm. Ba -ba 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 you should also probably know that the A in 10A stands for ambitious, because you should always have the attitude that you can snipe someone from obscene distances. Target eliminated! Suck a little less, scrub! On a quick side note, I think we need to make a Kickstarter for all those players who suffer from APJS, also known as Ammo Pouch Jiggle Syndrome. You know what I'm talking about, like, you can just be staring at a dead body, nothing's really happening, then out of nowhere, some guy will just flail himself onto your screen and start twerking his waist. Deja vu, I've just been in this place before, higher on the street, and I know it's my time to go. Going you and the search is a mystery. Please don't patch this dice, I secretly love it. I think the reason that I know the 10A is overpowered is because I can actually do well with it on a consistent basis. Because you know that in comparison to most of you, my aim is atrocious. But even with me consistently missing easy shots, I can still dominate, which tells me there's a problem. The biggest piece of advice
advice I have for this thing, apart from teaching yourself how to perform a moving teabag, which is, I'm not even mad about, how does he do that? <clears throat> the biggest piece of advice I have for you about the 10A is to be patient. I know you're like me and you want to whip out your shoddy like John Gotti and scramble around killing everyone, but it is a smart idea just to take your time. Flank around the enemy and try to get as much as your pellets on target as possible, even if that means taking an extra breath or a split second. Oh, I've killed you a lot! The only real downside of the weapon is that you end up killing so many people that running out of ammo is normally an issue. Oh god, look at this guy. He's... Is he actually running an automatic machine gun instead of a sh... What? What? Why? And that's about it. Tune in next... No. 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 Push the man. Take me by the hand. Lead me to the land that you understand. I will admit it. I, I know that Ocean Man is cancerous, but when my brain's at idle, when I'm not thinking about anything at all, what's going on up there? Ocean Man. Oh, it's, oh. I wish I could get rid of it, but I can't. I just can't. But that's really about it. Be sure to tune in next time when we make the nade spam in this game even worse by using a silly crossbow. <laughs>